Look, I think Trump is more from my world than he is from politics. You know, we, we, he's, my, he's, he's one of us. He's a showbiz guy. He's an entertainer. He's an entertainer. So I feel like we're responsible for him. Yeah, you know us. what I hear? I hear this making his way into your routine. No, I don't think so. I think I, gotta, I, gotta, I think I said everything I need to say about <laughs> Donald Trump. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, here's where I, I, I felt a little bit bad because mm. a lot of people got mad at me and they said, uh, sh just shut up. Just shut your mouth. Don't tell me. You know, a lot of times when you we say, don't, we don't know tell you. me what to think, right? I'm not telling anybody what to think. I'm just, I'm expressing myself during an election You're year. telling them what you think. Yeah, that's right. Um, but I did come into their lives yeah. through the funny haha -ha door. And then I took a big political serious on their table. So I get being irritated. I get it. I get it. I get why people would be irritated with my having written that. It's not what I do best. It's not what I'm known for. It's not what I'm asked about. You know what I mean? I mean, if you invited somebody to your house because you knew they were really funny and fun, and then they just said all this stuff, you'd be like, what, what are you doing to me? So I get why people got irritated. It's interesting to me. A lot of liberals got mad because I suggested that maybe conservatives and liberals have equal value and that they should each have a shot at running the government. Right. I mean, that's just the way that I was raised. I came from Mexico when I was a little kid. I lived in Mexico. Right. And I remember coming to America and discovering it as a little boy from another country. And the idea of democracy and free speech was just an incredible thing to me. And it's still, I look at it with wide open eyes. I'm very innocent that way. And the way, the way I look at the world is that um, I feel a certain way about how the way a country should be run. But not everybody feels the way I do. So when there's enough of me to push the election over to our side, we get a president for a while. Yeah. But the other side, who feels differently than I do, they should get an equal shot. Um, because it's not all my country. It's a lot of people's country. You know what I mean? Yeah, of course I do. So democracy shouldn't... Some people think democracy means I always get things the way I want them. Well, I don't look no, at it that way. Yeah, exactly. I mean, democracy means sometimes I'm really frustrated with the way the government yeah. works. Then I know it's working right. Um, that's the way I look at it, and I'm in my 40s, and so to me, Obama's a liberal. He's a liberal president. To some people, he's a arch, he's a huge conservative. It right. depends on how you look at it. Everybody looks at it differently. Okay. But I don't think Trump is any of these things. I think Trump is a guy who will dismantle the actual process. That's the only reason I said something. I'm not known for making political statements. I've never done this before. I, there's no, I have no track record of running my mouth politically. Will you do it again? No, I probably won't. But the reason I did in this case was because this isn't about I believe in the liberal cause and I want a liberal. It was because this guy feels like he could chuck it all away. And he's even saying he wants to. He's saying he wants to make it that you can sue people for writing something you didn't like. Yeah. You know, it's insane. So anyway, I shouldn't have said even what I said now. But, <laughs> but you did. I shouldn't have written it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. You don't mean that. No, not at all. <laughs> no.